Welcome viewers to Joy's Cooking. Here we go. Chuck that pan on the stove, look at that. Get it nice and smoking hot and we chuck them onions in there. Give them a bit of a beat around with that uh, spatula. Get them a bit nice and brown. Nice hot oil. Today we're cooking pork adobo. Mm -hmm. She's good stuff. I'd put a few inches around your tummy if you eat too much of it. But she's good tucker. Straight from the Philippines and stuff. That's it, get them onions nice and brown. Yeah, add the garlic. This is the one, the old garlic. Yeah, I like it. Keeps away the colds and flus, makes a bit of snot drip out of the nose now and again, but I tell you what, she's good stuff. Could even fight off COVID too, I reckon. Well, there you go, mix it all up, get it nice and brown. Yeah, that's it, let it sizzle away for a bit there. Bit of punishment. No, look at it. Now we got the wooden spoon into it. Look at that. The old wooden spoon's coughed a bit of a pizzle over the days. Looks like she's been left on the top of the stove and cooked a bit. Yeah, a bit of a smoky flavour to your dish, that one. There we go. And there's that pork. That pork's boiled for about 15 minutes to get a bit of that excess fat out of there. That's pork belly. That's what you want to use. That's the good stuff. So you chuck her in there and give her a bit of a mix about. Eat her up with that wooden spoon again. Tell you what, I used to get a bit of that wooden spoon when I was a young bloke across the arse, too, when I was naughty. That pork's cotton now. Sit that around. Mm, let it sizzle for a bit. There you go, she's starting to hop around. Four bars, not dead, look at that. Easy, you have to knock that one down a bit. There, give her a bit of a touch up. Old pork's jumping around, poor old pig. What's going on there? This pig died to make us happy, ladies and gentlemen. For all those vegans out there and the grass eaters and that, I've tried to eat grass, maybe damn sick, so I had to go back to eating meat. I'll give her a bit of a wind around there. Get her all coated with that garlic and onion flavour, that's what we want. That's it, she's nice and brown now, that onion and that, she's pork's browning up nicely. Mm -hmm. This is going to be a bit of okay. You can make this with chicken and either chicken and pork or either pork on its own or chicken on its own. I've never had it with beef, but I reckon it'd be damn good with beef as well. She's, a, she's a, one of my favourites. Yeah, smother it a bit, put that lid on. Look at the heat going on there. Look at that. Magic. Okay. That's it. Now I think we're going to add some other ingredients. A bit of a beat up with the wooden spoon again. That's the way. Oh. Tell you what, I'm a damn good cook when I'm watching. A real good cook. I do a damn good job. Might get thrown a few things thrown out before um. Being a bit nasty at times, but I'm a damn good cook. What I'm doing here? Hey? You like me females, folks? I can put that on line soon too, because I'm damn good at doing them too. Okay. Now, the other ingredients. Here we go, the old soy sauce. Got a bit of that. You know, see that? That's it. Straight from the Philippines, this stuff. Look at that. Thick as motor oil, that's what you want. Chuck a bit in there. Same as the old Toyota when she gets an oil change. Couple of tablespoons. Oh, she's good stuff. That's it, give her a mix up there. Maybe the old wooden spoon that's been cooked on the top of the stove again. So one. Um, you think we're making videos we can afford a new wooden spoon, but she's an old family favourite, so we keep her. Nice. No use chucking grandma out because she's farting too much. So we keep her because she's old. There we go, that one. Look, that's a, that's a hard... See that one? He don't want to turn over, does he? There we go. He's over now. Oh, that looks really nice. So, you add due for the next ingredient, I think. Yep, here we go. And what is the next ingredient? It's the lid. Oh, yeah, I'm not a very good cook after all, am I? Oh, the lid's coming off again. That was quick. I think that just got done to fool me, to be honest with you. You see how that's 
nicely percolating away there and it's created a bit of juice with that soya sauce. So now we throw the bay leaves in. Give them a bit of a cook around. Not too many bay leaves, just one or two broken up by hand. Don't have to get too professional and chop them up. Now here we go, the peppercorns are coming up now. We can chuck them in, that's the go. Peppercorns, give it a bit of a flavour happening. We can't forget the main ingredient, in my opinion, the magic syrup, that's the one. Now you've got to go to the Asian shop to get this stuff. That's it, put her in, put a lot in, I like it. Yeah, she's good for you. The old double hips, Captain. And then, the old chilies. Now, not too much of this, folks. We don't want to be paying for, the, for it, eating too many chilies on the toilet next morning. And be bad. That's it, chuck a few in, that's enough. Very nice. Get a bit more of a beat up with the wooden spoon. Yeah, chuck her in, in there. There you have it, folks. Just about getting to the end of it. Look at that. That looks really nice. Give it a toss around. I'll have to put a lid on her soon just to let her boil a bit. Oh, wait on. Wait on. I think we're missing something here. I think there's one more ingredient. But let's wait and see. Yeah, I think there's one more ingredient that left to happen here. The old Filipino vinegar. There she is. A Filipino vinegar. Can't get that in Australia unless you go to the Asian shop. She's good stuff. It's good for coughs, cold, medicine. Got a sore on you, put it on there. You want to poison the next door neighbour's cat, give it a teaspoon of that and we'll be gone next day. I'll tell you what, she's good stuff. That's it. Chuck a bit on her and let her simmer down. Picking up a bit. And, uh... She's really good stuff. Okay, folks, that's about it for me. You let that simmer down. Serve her up on a nice bed of rice. I'll tell you what, you'd think you died and gone to heaven.